How's it going everyone? Welcome back and today we're going to talk about App Store Surge is not working on iPhone. Maybe you're trying to look for some application, either it says no results or it just keeps loading and loading and loading. If you ever encountered a your search, it simply doesn't work on your iPhone on App Store, here is how to solve it. First of all, all you guys need to do here, you simply need to do a simple work, okay? If you open up your App Store already, then all you need to do is simply swap down from the top here and come to the App Switcher and simply remove your app store from the background and simply restart your iPhone. That's the very primary thing that you guys can do to solve your problems. After that, once you just restart your iPhone, check your problem is solved or not. Still, if you see, well, your problem is not solved at all, then you gotta head over to your settings on iPhone here. And now, all you gotta do, you gotta scroll down and tap App Store. And here, make sure you're actually enabling, enabling these four settings. If you see these four are actually disabled, make sure to enable it at the very same time you want to scroll down and tap personalized recommendation and here you got to tap clear app uses data tap clear app uses data here tap done and again you have to restart your iPhone and see what happens so after following this couple of ways I can tell you guys your problem is going to be solved however if you still have problem the next thing that I want you guys to take a look at open up your browser and simply type fast.com all right, so if you come to the fast.com here, this website will let you know how speed you are currently having with your network. You can see mine is pretty bad. So if you have the bad internet connection here, then you can simply swap down from the top here, enable airplane mode and wait around some time like 10 to 20 seconds. And after that, turn it off. Or you can switch your network. You can, uh, you know, enable, you know, cellular data instead of Wi-Fi or you can do the vice versa. You can use Wi-Fi and turn up the cellular data if you are using cellular data on your iPhone. Now after that, so go and take a look at your problem and see what happens. After following this, I can tell you your problem is going to be solved. However, if you still have a problem, last thing you guys can do, you can open up your settings on iPhone again. And this time you gotta head over to general and here you want to take a look at your date and time make sure your date and time is set correctly and then you want to scroll down tap transfer and reset iphone tap reset and simply select reset network settings most likely after giving every network settings on your iphone your problem is going to be solved however if you still have problems on your iphone please let me know in the comment section guys see you all around